Hey guys, I've created a space underneath my footer image, um, a space that I'm going to put some links into. So I've inserted one big div tag called links box and inside that links box div tag I've created five other div tags and those are footer box one, two, three, four and five. Now I got them to line up this way because I floated all the div tags and I'll be doing a tutorial in the next few days on floating div tags. Now if you wanted to insert the whole thing, the whole div tag and all the five div tags inside of it, um, you can do that if you have another page with the same CSS attributes applied to it. And what I mean by that is if you was to copy all of the code from code view into a blank HTML document that didn't have the CSS attributes applied to it, then all of the div tags would collapse. So what I'm going to do is open up a copy of uh, this web page and it's already got the attributes applied to it for the CSS. So when I copy it in, all of the attributes hopefully will all align and uh, all the boxes will be the same width. Okay, so let's work out what part of the code we need to copy from code view in order to take it over to our other page. Now I know the first div tag is called footerbox1 so if I highlight some of the text in design view from footerbox1 it will show up in code view. So give me an idea of where I need to go and we can see that the links box div is there so if I highlight the links box that will give me everything inside the links box as well. So I'm going to click and drag and highlight the start of the div tag for links box and the end of the links box div tag and I'm going to edit copy and that will copy all of the information from code view that I've selected if I go into my other page and I'm going to place all of the div tags um, that I've copied at the bottom of this page as well underneath the footer image so if I click on the footer image and I'm going to press the right arrow key on my keyboard and that will place the cursor just after the footer image and that's where we want it to be so we'll paste the code into code view and then I'm just going to go and double click on the CSS styles panel to bring up the refresh button and I'm going to click that and we can see it has appeared at the bottom of the footer image I know that the attributes are still in place because otherwise the div tags would have all collapsed let's preview it in the browser OK, I'm going to go down to the bottom of the page. And there it is, it's all appeared. Let's test one of the links out. OK, fantastic. So whenever you copy div tags with attributes from one page to another, make sure the CSS goes with it. Thank <laughs> you.